Data visualizations conveying real-life physical phenomena and properties, such as bar charts and size diagrams, aim to assist in comprehension through visual comparisons with related objects or beings. Similarly, concrete scales associate physical measurements and quantities with more familiar units to help build mental models of scale. Even so, these approaches are inherently abstract and potentially hard to understand, requiring cognitive effort to accurately envision the intended mental imagery of the real-world phenomena. In addition, certain data types such as speed can be challenging to comprehend through static images or analogy alone. Through the use of virtual reality, however, we can instead simulate these at true-to-life scales and allow users to viscerally experience the data for themselves in a manner not otherwise possible on flat 2D screens due to restrictions such as size. Take for example the Olympics 100m men's sprint. While speed is fundamental to the race, it is instead officially expressed in seconds in the tabular format. The sprinters certainly look fast in the video replay, but it is unclear exactly how fast they are running without being there in person. Some data stories, such as the one race every medalist ever by the New York Times, illustrate the progression of race times in the Olympics by comparing distance from the finish line when the fastest, Usain Bolt in 2012, crosses it. It does so both in a scattered plot-like visualization and a data video with computer-generated imagery. This does effectively communicate how much faster Bolt is compared to the competition, but it still does not provide a sense of how fast he was actually running. By using VR, we can achieve this by simulating each sprinter at the speed they would be moving at in real life, giving users a visceral, first-hand understanding of it. We build upon this concept in what we call data visualizations, which are data-driven experiences which evoke visceral feelings within users to facilitate intuitive understanding of physical measurements and quantities. We explore and elaborate on data visualizations in VR in a series of six design probes. These are VR prototypes based on real-life examples that we critically evaluated to capture important aspects and themes. The first three involve readily perceivable mappings from reality, whereas the remaining three involve some form of hurdle which may impact viscerality. In the rest of this video, we briefly showcase parts of these VR prototypes. Based on the aforementioned example and the One Race Every Medalist Ever piece, we recreate its video and 3D models. Users can replay the race at will and watch it from any angle they wish to viscerally witness the actual speed of the runners, something not otherwise possible in real life. Similar to the previous design probe, Bob Beeman's Long Olympic Shadow showcases the difference in distance jump between the Olympic medalists. Instead of relying on the basketball three-point line as a concrete scale, however, users can directly see the distance that each one jumped for themselves in a one-to-one -one scale with reality. We recreate the popular size diagram of skyscrapers to explore how height can be viscerally experienced. As compared to a static viewpoint, users can judge for themselves the large scale of these structures from a wide range of perspectives, such as from below, from the top of a building, or from a long distance away. There exist many examples which put into perspective the enormous scale of the solar system by rescaling it into graspable ranges. To explore the effects of this rescaling on visualization, we implement a related example, fitting all planets between the Earth and the Moon, where VIA allows users to view these scaled-down planets from a wider range of angles. To explore quantities, we recreated a snippet of the Hong Kong protests to understand how counts of discrete objects, in this case people, can be experienced. This includes being in the crowd itself, or flying above it in a helicopter-like fashion. Finally, we looked at representing abstract quantities as visceral experiences by using the concrete scales principle with the US depth. Users can directly experience the sheer scale of the depth as if it was physically there in front of them to see. Please refer to the paper for critical reflections of these design probes. Thank you for watching.